is this thing not? <clears throat> Why is it not? It should be. This just looks weird. Did someone come in and mess with my mic stand while I wasn't paying attention? Probably. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Colonel Cross again. Oh, we're kind of slow. He can't mess with Mike stance. He doesn't have thumbs. Okay, first thing. Hold on, hold on. Okay, so we changed that last time. Good. It's very Final Fantasy VIII. I'm making an executive decision with the party. As soon as I start. Calling to confirm that the internet people are coming out tomorrow. Because my internet's been doing strange things. Speaking of internet doing strange things, my internet is doing strange things. So, uh, potential for the stream to go down. I don't know how potential that is, but it, there's potential for it. Um, and also we're about to have a, <coughs> excuse me, a bit of weather. So. Just, uh, to forewarn ya. I, I. Let's get on the boat. Boats are fun. Yay, boats. Woo. That's what you say when you have a boat. Woo. Yay, boat. Oh, I need. I didn't open my thing. <clears throat> hey, uh, peace tea. If you want to sponsor a streamer, I'd take a case or two of a uh, Caddyshack. Just saying. We have a uh, a puzzle. Puzzles to solve here. Not the Black Omen music, but pretty good. A dragon on the floor. Look at him. All two-dimensional. Okay, pick a door. Uh, call it 9, 11, 1, and 3. 9, 11, 1, or 3. Pick one, I don't care which. Three it is! Is it that button? Yeah, it's that button. That button will be important, I think, for this very room. We have puzzles to solve. See, if I open that box, it makes this thing move. And then this guy gets very upset with me. It's a Google. Google. Start like that, huh? Here's the doctor. He juggles knives and has a uh, Triforce tattoo. He's 
he's not too bad. I've not used him very much, um, mostly because he is a white element. Surge is also a white element. Pip is a white element. And, uh... There's a couple other white element characters. I think there are fewer white than anything else, except there may be... F oh. I don't know. Mojo? Let's see. Uh... Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I actually don't know if it's a Triforce tattoo or not. Because there are other games where it's like, ah, triangles, that's the thing. I wanted to look at Doc's, uh, thing, and we didn't do it. So there's a door there. We want to go in that door. There's also a door up here we want to go in. So we... It does look fairly dry forcey. <clears throat> it wouldn't surprise me if it is, but I can't say for certain. Look at that puzzle we just solved. Man. Good thing we're not Phil. Oh no! It's a private and a dragoon. Really? Y'all killing me here. Ow. I can miss and you get critically hit, so that's not fair. Really? 90% you missed twice. Final Fantasy Tactics all over again. Pushing buttons. Just got hit with the cack breath. Okay. High five. Throw your weapons high in the air. That's not going to help anybody. So, we also recruited Lucia, the scientist lady. The Doc is kind of the inverse of her. Same weapons, same type of attacks, but instead of being um, a black element, he's white. I think her magic's a little better, I think his uh, damage is a little better when he hits things. Which is apparently not very often. Uh, Kid has that stamina ring thing we got last time. So if you look at her stamina recovery, right now it's 4.8. So instead of getting one back, she gets, I guess, 1.2. Since uh, a couple of people's grids have gotten big enough, we now unlocked second level techs. This is kids' second level tech. That's a little better than Docs. Docs isn't very good. But level 5 Doc, he doesn't have his yet. Everybody's element grid grows at a different rate. There's not a fixed. You know. And some people have really terrible grids. Some people have really good grids. One of the characters we could have picked up when we uh, recruited Pierre has an inverted grid. It's really short on the lower levels and really big on the higher levels. There's not too many people who have that. Oh, I need to 
put it there. And over here. Since we have four rooms to do here, uh, we will take a different party member for each of the rooms. How's that? That sound exciting? Oh boy! Forget what that does. I think it makes you immune to blue status effects. <coughs> oh, Anti-blue. Excuse me. It's a little different. Look at this puzzle, man. Did you guys know that the final boss of Metroid Prime is a puzzle boss because you can't just shoot it? You actually have to, like, wait to shoot it. You can't just mash the shoot button and win. There's a button. It makes stairs fall down. Okay, uh, we were fighting something at one point that got called kind of creepy. And I said there's something more creepy, and it's this guy. This guy's creepy. I know he may not look all that creepy. But he's pretty creepy. What page am I on? on that page. This is Giant Gloop. Look how creepy he is. You can see through him. Semi-transparent things are very creepy. He didn't take a lot of damage there. He's creepy. Um, let's defend for now. Of course, we're going to steal from him. He's nothing but a pocket. He's got to have something. An antiviral cap. Careful. Don't tell the anti-mask people. That's a Liam Neeson movie. Okay, so that kind of hurt a little bit. So we're gonna we're gonna try and fix that. She's also got a blue thing. Probably the flu. I think blue is the flu. Which I think is just general fat reduction across the board. the stamina. Our stamina is real bad. It's probably gonna hurt. Yeah, I'd say that hurt just a little bit. Iceberg is a pretty high level um, 
water spell. Do you have? You do. Gooey goo again. The last thing I need. That's what happens during an earthquake. Pillars shoot up out of the ground and then do like a Mario Brothers thwomp thing. Uh, I don't know if you've noticed. Giant Gloop's physical defense is kind of high. There's Surgeon's level 5. Look at that, it's weak. Finally. Oh, don't interrupt me. At least he doesn't drain health, I guess. Frozen? I find it hard to believe that that thing is cold. It's melting. Cold things don't melt. They melt when they get warm. We're at the star. Still a good level for kid. That guy, we talk to this thing, it says, oh, okay, I'll go away then. And then wherever that is, that happened. But the holes on the floor kind of look like that thing. Weird. Because we hit that switch, we can we can just leave. Now from the blue element boss, we stole the thing that protects against blue uh, status elements, which is going to be great when we fight everything that's not the blue boss. Okay. We haven't seen Poshal in a bit, so let's take Poshal. <clears throat> so I'm just making the decisions this time. I can deal with it. Nine, three, or one. Nine, three, or one. Boy. 
This one. This one's gonna take a little longer. It's not a puzzle so much as it is a maze. Hi, robot. We fought Roborgs back in Viper Manor. These are not Roborgs. These are Cybots. They're stronger. They barely hurt the thing. There is an attack in Chrono Trigger called Red Pin. It works nothing like that. It's also a Luminaire attack in Chrono Trigger, which is Surge's level 5 tech. It is, um... Similar, I guess, to the one that Surge has. A little different. And now you know. Partial strength, 25. Hmm, ridiculous. Okay, so there's some treasure chests we want to make sure we get. I think that door is where we want to go. You probably saw the, the thing, that thing. We'll fight this thing. This thing is annoying. It's got a not very pleasant attack. Paper boy! Look at look at him. His eyes not even attached to his head. What a loser. We brought Poshal, the yellow character, down the corridor where everything is yellow. Here's uh, Poshal's new level 5. Doggy done it. Isn't that adorable? Uh, there is not an attack in Chrono Trigger based on that. Just so you know. Okay, now all we gotta do is run around and pick stuff up. We fought everything over here. Enemies don't respawn, which is nice. If I remember right, though, the robots will jump from level to level to try and get to you, I think. Bush Basher, that's a good spell. And heal all is good, too. Let's see. Guess not. Thought so. Must have been in one of the other areas. <clears throat> There's our switch to drop the shortcut staircase. It's just like Dark Souls! 
Chrono Cross is the Dark Souls of the Chrono Trigger games. Oi! That's not as effective as I was hoping it was going to be. So we talked about real early in this playthrough that initially I didn't like the stamina thing because I didn't understand it very well. Um, but I've come to appreciate it more because if this was Chrono Trigger and we were fighting these super ultra death robots, um, all I would have to do to kill them all is just, you know, pick a Chrono or pick Luca or pick somebody and just, you know, go right to the bottom of their magic thing and use the strongest magic spell they had and kill everything in the first round. That was beautiful, Surge. Thank you. And, uh... You know, I don't like doing it that way because I think that's boring. I really hate using techs as much as I'm using them now, but... I'll be here all day if I don't. Just give me one hit. Just enough to do that. That should do it. So while I can still use the super ultra ultimate death spells, you know, I actually have to put a little time into getting them ready. Since this game is an MP based. Just I think it makes for a more interesting experience, that's all. You guys are not too worried about Xing. That's their thing. Paper Moon, and it hurts! Since these guys actually don't have a whole lot of defense, we can mash our way through those fights. Because the paper dudes are kind of hard to avoid. Another one in here? I think I heard it. Yep. Four of them. Super Ultra Death Magic for them. Uh oh. What are they doing? Rides is all jiggly. Oh boy, all these capsules. 
There's one area in the game where we might actually need them. We found a trap for Tornado. <clears throat> Am I gonna need that? I don't know. green anyway. Stupid camera backed me into a corner and I couldn't walk around it. I knew you could do that. Didn't want to fight me. He was just showing off. Oh, he's got bats with him. Not to be confused with the other bats. These are alpha bats. It's just, it's just fine. Just miss. Miss everything. I don't care. Zero damage. Yeah, that's rough. Good job, you kicked a robot. I hate going over and over to the same elements because I think that gets boring too, but it's probably the best one I got for this situation. We haven't talked about it, but there's a status ailment for every color. We've seen flu and uh, poison and burn. White, I think, is fatigue. And if you're fatigued, it, it makes your stamina recover slower. Oh, come on. A couple of the robots we fought we have hit with fatigue, but... It doesn't seem to matter much when the enemies get hit by it. He is fatigued. He is not. <clears throat> trying to not fight all the battles. We've talked about that. You know, when there's a lot of them, they're real samey. Um, Situation being, it's kind of hard to avoid battles in this area because the uh, these are so narrow. Don't open with that. Don't you open with that? That ain't cool. Oh, we got a new enemy. Reverse Batman. It's a 
combat. That's funny. Oh, you're not looking too good. So, combat shoots uh, lasers in the shape of himself. Of course. Everybody, that's what bats are known for. You ask, you ask a person you don't know, hey, what can you tell me about a bat? They're going to say, well, they shoot, shoot lasers in the shape of their own bodies. And if they answer anything other than that, you know they've never seen a bat before. They're no batologist. Oh, you. I think you're green. If Glenn was here, I think we can trap Tornado from this guy. I think. Yeah. Horasoid. <clears throat> For as big as he is. Um... Doesn't, uh, doesn't handle a hit near as well as the slime guy did. It does hit hard, though. He's got them wrestling moves. Do you still have? Yes, we're going to use that. Now you're not such a big deal. Give me something good. I already had one of those. I don't know that I would call that a backdrop. It's more like a... God damn it! Kind of a move, you know? Missing all of a sudden here. 
Don't do that. That's bad. the other gear thingy. Marshall. <clears throat> Excuse me. Stop interrupting. <laughs> I mean, I know it's not like throwing off my combo or anything here, but... Oh, two in a row, huh? You jerk. Hoping that you were gonna get enough charges on your grid to heal Surge a little bit, but no, I guess not. Really? How many of those you got? What's your grid look like? Show me. Show me yours, I'll show you mine. I'm gonna use heal all and put another green in there. Like all I got though. Some reason we didn't end up with a cure plus. with the missing today. Don't need that. Oh, you can just do normal attacks, huh? You've only done the 37 elements in a row this fight without a single normal attack. I had no idea. No idea. Man, he didn't melt, he turned into triangles. Fate worse than death. Of course that's a star. Believe it. Marshall. I don't think you need more strength. You need some agility. Well, he had a carapace. I don't need it now. I made my new spoons. So we fought a blue boss and a green boss. There's none of one of those things. Um, what do you suppose the odds are that we're gonna have to fight a red and a yellow boss too? Think they're pretty good. Maybe a white and a black boss. 
I think it's probably a safe bet. I'd be willing to bet your life on it. I've always been willing to put you at great personal risk for the sake of my art. Alright, let's play as our art. It's like video games. <clears throat> Uh, let's see. Three o'clock or nine o'clock? Three o'clock? Yeah, vote for nine. Nine it is. Let's see. Oops, not that button. This button. for this one. You good? Oh man, armor is terrible though. Oh well, it'll be fine. Nine o'clock. We will finish this room. I don't think we can do it in 10 minutes. But we'll finish this one and then we'll take our break. Oh no, this one's not bad. This one's not... It's not hard, but it's time consuming, I guess. We've seen you before. Hooray for Matcha getting a hit point. So there's our button. This guy. You might have noticed, um, I'm pushing buttons. <coughs> Excuse me. As I was saying, you might have noticed there in the middle of the room is the thing we need to, to touch. Okay. How do we do it? Crazy. So there's no boss in this one. Let's go investigate this room. Look, feetses. Gorgonians are made of head, body, and tail. To change the order. Okay. So this is head, body, and tail. We are currently in head, body, and tail. That means Surge is the head, Kid is the body, Watch is the tail. You get it? We step on that thing, and it changes this room by putting these things in out and it moves some platforms around. So if we press select, we are now body, tail, head. Jump back in here, stand on the thing. Blop, bloop, blop, blop, bloop, bloop. So it took the platform away here. Put it up here. Oh boy, an earth charm. 
select again. We are now tail, head, and body. Blah, bloop, blah, blah, blue. You don't need to hear that ever again. <clears throat> okay, what did that do for us? Put our platform right there. Nothing else in this room. We can read that thing, I guess. So now what we need to do is we need to change the position of the tail and the body. It gives us head, tail, and body. Wait. Just a fancy schmancy way and a short, easy way of swapping position two and three. Put the platform there where it's of no use to us. Check this out. something good. That'll let us get up there. So let's get up there and read that. So we're going to want to do this one last. <clears throat> and here I thought we weren't going to have time. ta There's nothing else to get over here. Stick surge back up front. Talk to the shiny thing. Hello, shiny thing. Look at you being all shiny. Look at you going away. You're much less shiny now. I apologize for all I've done. Forgive me my transgressions. be a minute or two early, but we'll go back to the, uh, to the hub room, I guess. We'll swap out Matcha. Ooh, you know. Two battles, but that's how, it's just how it goes. <clears throat> I like it with you two are Horrible, horrible idea. Didn't get to see her at uh, level 5. Handle foes as if you're folding your laundry. This game is sexist. Hmm. Okay, so the next one's probably gonna be red. So we'll have a quick, uh, quick poll. Do we want Lena or Pierre? Uh oh. Dissension in the ranks. Flip a coin. Heads Lena tells Pierre. Heads it is. Sorry, Pierre. I was hoping it was gonna be you, man. I really was. Got. 
maiden heart. That sounds terrible. Why would I need that? Oh well. Let's save. That's Nikki. What's he doing here? Break time. A juicier apple is a better tasting apple, and a juicier, better tasting fruit.